Um, I'm going to start. Let me just um, just take my box because you have to have a box of stuff, you know. Um, so this is one of the boxes that I got uh, for. Um, it says cut stamped printed images. So I am going to fill this thing up. So smaller images and stuff like that. And I'm going to take another one that has... Uh... So this one is this. Oh, something fell out. And... I'm going to do another one that it's like junk journal thingy for bigger pictures and stuff. I just know, I don't know how to set myself up right now, but I'll just put them on my um, bin because, and this is the uh, junk journal one. You can see I have bigger pictures inside. Um, I just love this, this one. And uh, yeah. Let's slowly start. Welcome, Lisa. Um, I hope you're gonna fussy cut with me as well and do some embellishments today. Um, okay, so just I can tell you what's on my table right now. I have um, this is some paper from the flower-ish something book that I just cut out and these dots were actually um, sorry I'm out of frame uh, these dots were actually when when the flowers have to be um, put in the in the ground and stuff and I really liked it cut it out and watercolor it on it so I love this um, and I'm going to put probably this with backgrounds or something like that, or painted papers. Not sure yet. Still have to do some things on that. Um, let me see. Yeah, again, I just painted it. I like it. Uh, I like the text and stuff. A little wash. And a regular one. And you can use that for backgrounds, so it's so cool to do that. Um, I do have some stamping ready. I'm just gonna do a little bit of that too. Um, so these are some clothing tag that I did today very quickly. Um, they are actually, um, I don't know if you can see it well. Um, these are just some cutouts from um, envelopes that I made and I just glued them on. Um, and this is that same paper that I showed you. This strip was just some um, cut off from an image. Same book. And yeah, same paper as before. And this was the bag from um, Flower. Uh, flower. No, how do you say Flower? No, it's not Flower. Fix it to Mocha. Flower. Yeah, okay, it's flower. So flowers on top of the flower. <laughs> um, and okay, the other thing that I did, um, just to show my quick my tags off, um, just some scraps. This is just something that I had on my watercolors for a very long time, and I wanted to put it on. Um, and I think it looks nice. And again, another little one just playing with whatever I was working um, and I like this um, where you can see that it's actually not together this was actually another um, the other end of this piece and I just cut it and it looks like it's you know it's the same table but just a little bit of space in between and I like I like that looks nice um, looks grungy, I think. 
This one is another one that I made, um, just strips of the, that same paper that I showed you that I watercolored. And this was a something and I watercolored as well because I think it looks nice. And the other side, I don't know about the colors, but I can see them perfect on my um, tablet. Okay, and this one, this one was like, I very much like it. Um, so this was the envelope that my Happy Mail um, came and I just cut them out and did this and I think looks very nice and just random piecing. This is advertisement and this is something, I don't know, even scrap that I'm hoarding for so long. And uh, the others are the same. These are just those additional ones that were empty and I didn't fill them up. Um, so yeah. That's all. Okay, just have to breathe and uh, try to start um, doing stuff. And I do keep these pieces so um, you can put them on your uh, whatever you're doing, right? Because um, I think they, they look nice as a strips because they... Most of the time when I'm trimming, they're, they're gonna be... Um, they're gonna be straight, so it's not um, like not straight. <laughs> and I'm gonna keep those. Um, and even this, I was thinking to just make a washi out of them. If you guys are interested, how how should I do that? Um, how I want to do that? Um, let me know in the comments below, uh, because I um, I have a lot of cut off cutoffs from the paper when I just want to use text, so there is plenty of these babies. Um, and probably I would doodle or something. Um, but only if you're interested, I, I'd love to share. Um, I'm going to take these pencils and let me put them away. So, um, I'm gonna use this, definitely, just like probably do dollar store um, notepad, I think it's called. Um, yeah, okay. So, let's begin. I am going to show you... I'll try to go from the beginning, let's say, and uh, I think I should remove this, but, well, now it's too late. Because um, it it's annoying me. I always have like full stuff around my computer um, and speakers. I don't know why, just too lazy to put stuff away. Um, so let's start with um, those pictures that are actually... Um... Okay, just storage-wise, I've showed you, you, you can use boxes like this, right? Um, they're small boxes. Uh, you can use boxes from um, anything. I like that it opens on, on the top. I like that. I don't like those that I have to open here and then throw everything out and then put them back in. So I like that it's like, um, um, uh, I don't know how to say it. Um, hello Stephanie, hello Eden! And, um, this is another thing that I just came, uh, that I just found. This is actually a tray from, um, Rams, so I am going to reuse this and I, I like it because I see, I can see it through. And what else? I can open it and uh, all the small small bits bits not beads all the small bits i can <laughs> set it again i can put inside and actually see what it's inside and um the the seal it's it's tight so i am going to reuse this kind of uh, packaging as well um and it's sturdy so just for you to know how to actually store all the small stuff and um Let's just start what I have right now on uh, prepared, almost prepared, 
I have, I have these cuties. Um, if I have a feeling that something is very white, I am going to take some pencils and color it in. Um, I could use yellow as well, but I just went with um, reddish. Uh, looks like pink to me. Um, yeah, thank you, Stephanie. Uh, it, it is a little bit laggy though, um, I have to say, whenever you write something, I cannot see it instantly, so, um, that you'll know that it's, it is lagging, even when I'm watching my same stream, it's way behind. <laughs> so, I am going, I, um, cut this out of the magazine, uh, sorry, um, book, and I am cutting this out, um, slowly and uh, I do keep these bits that are empty for some weird reason of mine um, let's do this let's do this first one um, I like to leave the borders and stuff this is just quick thingy so there is not so much paper for me and uh, it's easier for me and like I said, I am keeping this baby. Um, I have to always decide which which flower I like best when I try to do that. So if I can decide, I scan it and then use it as, you know. Then I'm not so bothered. I don't go into... Maybe I should have to check where it is. Oh yeah, I did scan all of these um, that I'm gonna show you right now, um, just because I I I can I cannot do that. <laughs> mm, second. Hope you guys are going to fussy cut as well. Uh, I, I have a feeling that this these flowers look... For me, they look vintage even though they're not on that paper. And I, I do go back and retouch it, because I always do that. Somewhere I just leave too much border, like here. I don't like that very much, so I'll try to um, go slowly around and just... And this paper is thicker. It's not like copy paper, so... Um... Not that that is bad. In here as well. Let me just touch that up. Oh, I'm out of frame. That was not my Tesla on the floor. I think it's good. It's good enough. Oh, come on, Flavi. Um, let me just clean my table. Yeah, it's way over. And, uh, 
And I can even see this these images that were on the back. They are not so um, sharp, how I can say. Um, and these ones, they are because um, they are bigger pictures, and probably these were um, scaled down, so I can see it looks. Um, it doesn't look that nice. That's what I'm wanting to say. So what are you guys doing? What is everybody doing if not fussy cutting? Because I know you guys came just to fussy cut here. Right? <laughs> Thanks, hon. Is the music like too loud or is just muted a little bit in the background or... Because for my sanity, I really need something to, you know, because I'm not listening to myself. I'm just talking and you can listen to myself and... I am just without anything. My boyfriend's not talking. He's quiet and he's right next to me, but you know. He's yawing. I have very dirty scissors from today. <laughs> Was that a second time his phone fell off? No, this um, is the second phone. Oh, this is the second phone. Maybe you should get less phones. Uh, I, what I usually do now, take the um, alcohol, usually helps the best. And just clean my scissors. It's um, glue everywhere because I'm impatient and just whenever I glue something down, I'm just going to cut it out, you know. So I have to come come under the thingy. Okay, we're good, I think. Um, let's say this is good enough. Um, so I have two beautiful, even now I think I should just scan it again. Um, they look beautiful, I think. Um, so, what Emma does with, oh sorry, what Emma does with actual, this paper, I've see, I, I, I can see that here is more white than here, um, because the flowers were um, on the way, so I'm going to use this space. For what, really? Um, eh, something like this, stamping. And I like to just have something right next to me so I can stamp, um, you know, and see what is going to fit. Maybe this, this, this is going to fit just nice. I did this one with um, dots on it, so I am trying to do more. This is a new stamp set that I got from Action when I was in Germany. So, uh, they have amazing stamps. I, the quality, they don't stink. The quality is very good. Um, very good. And, and I very much like it. Um, so this is going to go something like this. I hope you can see. Um, I'm not the great stamper. Uh, I'm trying my best. So, you know. Please don't judge me on that. <laughs> um, just trying to see to cover all the thingy and I have to move this. And I try not to move it like um, left or right. Oh, looks perfect. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to put a bunch of cups. 
a bunch of cups on um, so we can later um, cut it out and stuff. I don't have any cups, so this is going to be my first. And I don't want to rush. I really don't. Um, just trying to find <laughs> empty space. That's what I'm trying to do because it's not going to fit here. And I don't want to lose the uh, a little bit of image. Let's try to see if I have another image. Yes, I do. And whenever I do that, I like to stamp more at one time. Um, beautiful. Beautiful. Just beautiful. I like flowers for some reason. I thought I don't, but looks like I do very much. Probably my mother's fault. Thank you, Han. Hello, Didi. Welcome. Okay, another one, and then I'm switching to something else. And if maybe um, I do wipe it off though, just with cloth. Uh, if um, the stamp isn't good enough, like um, it's pale or just um, faint. I am just retouching it with my uh, black um, thingy, you know. Um, I'm gonna do another stamp now. Okay, let's try this cup as well never tried them um, so uh, they're still so very much stick okay this one is more wider and I just like to turn paper however I feel I am I'm, I'm comfortable of stamping you know it's it's hard for me to actually turn it and you know just keep that in mind whenever you're gonna stamp turn it however you feel comfortable stamping that's like important very much So, I'm making um, embellishments, that's what, what's gonna go on here, um, for whatever, basically. Um, trying to find some paper. Where? Oh, it's here. I'm trying to see if I'm gonna fit this here, but I don't think so. Maybe here. It's gonna be very tight. Let me try. Um, yeah, I'm trying that. Yep, that's great. Um, and this, this paper is, it's not glossy or it doesn't show any gloss, but it's, um, thicker and, um, uh, the ink sits on, so it needs a little while to dry. Just keep that in mind as well. Um, maybe you can see this. This is from the same stamp right here. And, oh, come on, colored it, um, it's, how is it called, bag, tea bag? And another thing is this small pieces of, uh, um, what you call it, fruit, <laughs> um, lemons. I mean, these are probably more orangey, oranges, so... Um, you can use really what whatever paper you have lying around and what was this was just um, watercolor um, when I 
did this and I just stamped, cut the edges off and this edge I just stamped, you know, it was exactly here, wow. So I like to use those edges because, um, let me show you, I have so, so, so not much of these edges. Um, you can probably see these are just from book book page edges, right? And uh, if the stamp is small enough, I can do that. Um, I can color it um, watercolors. So you have a lot, really a lot of options here um, when it comes to stamping. I'm going to clean the stamp off. Really good, really good stamps. Um, is there something else I would like to use? Not really. Not for now, at least. And I fall, um, fall in love with this, um, um, how is it called? The slice of lemon slice? Really love, love that. The only problem that I have now is where the heck is um sheet of oh my gosh let me just find it have it so this is this is let me just put it in um this is actually the brand um um craft sensation and they actually have them um like in Polish, I think, France, uh, Netherlands, and um, Germany. I think they have it there. Um, I don't know if still, but let's move on. Um, this block was in the same pa in in similar package. Um, this is another stamp set that I got. And maybe, because I have a lot of those strips, maybe I can try to use this as well. Um, I've never tried this yet. But I like this one, it's beautiful. Just wanted to make it straight, this. I think it is, if not, uh... so this time I am going to use one of these um, pads and I was thinking to go with green, I already have a few things here, postage stamps that I have the stamp set, um, love them, um, and I keep it in this small um, notepad just because um, I hate the mess with having papers everywhere so whenever I need something I just cut it out um, you see here's another one um, I just cut it out and uh, move on with my life <laughs> that's basically what I do I think this is gonna fit perfectly and I can do maybe three I don't know we'll see I love the simplicity of this um, this stamp right here, and I do have a cushion um, underneath because there's stacked papers of papers, so I like that as well. Just gently pressing. You can see that it's it's beautiful. That's what it is. Beautiful. Just gonna put it right here. Um, so what are people doing? Cleaning, reorganizing, fussy cutting, stamping. What are you guys doing right now? Even this, I love it. I would just leave it like this. Looks amazing. Could make a quote. I could just write a quote right here or put a stamp or something. 
I want to make another one. Because <laughs> I cannot fussy cut that. Just too beautiful. And I love to actually scan my... Even my uh, stamped images. Why, you might ask. Um, basically, sometimes I'm just not feeling stamping. That's why I stamp and scan. And then I can do whatever in Photoshop. Make it red, blue, whatever. And print it out. Or add it to something. Um, you know. If it's for me, it's good enough. Uh, if I do something with it. Yeah, it looks nice. It really does. <clears throat> oh, good girl! Cleaning! I'm going to take this back. So... Okay, we didn't even start with fussy cutting. And this one is, is beautiful as well. You have to say that, you know, it's it looks very gorgeous. Um, just wish they would make different sets like this with flowers. I, I'm in love with the flowers, obviously. And I have to say, in, in the last, how much, a uh, couple of days, I actually realized what I really, truly like. And what I don't, um, and what I don't, so I think this was like this, wasn't it? Um, which, which is, oh, I'm missing something, yeah, am I? Missing the back. Um, so I wanted to point that out that I didn't know before, so... And it's like two years now that I'm crafting. Oh, my nose is... Okay, it's good. It's all good. It's itching. And I don't want to sneeze. Okay, so the stamp said this one was um, 150 maybe? I don't know. Maybe it was 150 and the other one with the... Oh, where it is? Where it is? Oh, story of my life. Where do I put it? Where did I put it? Um, here you are. This was, um, let's say less than a dollar. I think 80 cents. I think. I'm not sure, but I think these were, these were 80 cents and these were... Um, a bit um, more and whenever I got to their stores and action stores the first store was so um, messed up oh my god if you could see that um, stuff everywhere where they don't belong and I couldn't find anything really um, so I had to take a lot of time uh, my boyfriend was freaking out because I was there for so long and he wanted to go just home, take a shower and stuff. And the other one that was um, that we that we went into was better organized, less people, because the first one had too much people. You couldn't just turn around and you know. And uh, trying to see if I have if I have some paper here. So let's just move on and cut more flowers. Or, maybe I can do this, yes. Uh, same pictures, stamped on. And what I'm going to do, I am going to use um, these beauties. Um, I've I've uh, seen the other store, um, action store, and they had more, um, more stuff, just not what I was looking for. Um, and they had, um, sorry, I'm trying to think and, uh, stay within, in, inside the lines, um, cause, 
whenever I try to fussy cut, if it's too like this spots and this, I try to fussy cut it around so it's a border around. Um, so with something like this, because it's just one one continuous line around and around, I would I would even um, color around and then just fussy cut it really close uh, with without any border. Um, and that is actually nice to just think um, think about what you're gonna do before you color it in and stuff like that. Um, so I was saying I have no clue. <laughs> Something about Action Store, I know that for sure, uh, but. Hello, Laura. Welcome. Didn't you say you're gonna make your life today? I think you said that. Maybe I'm confused. I don't know anymore. I don't know how... Okay, this is good. What do you mean, no way? You're not gonna make any life? I thought you you said you're gonna make life after um, um, after you watch some live or something. I'm confused. Oh yeah. So these pencils are actually good pencils cheap really cheap and they color like okay pastelli I would like to say I mean on this paper because if I color on something else oh gosh where is a paper I need a piece of paper um yeah because I have nothing to put on my piece of scrap Here's one. Here's another strip. Um, this is actually like this. So, uh, difference between this and, you know, because this is a little bit glossy or waxy. I can't decide which one is it. I have a feeling it's more waxy than, than anything else. Let me color the speckles, the circles first, so I can just go over with the color. Hope you can see. Um, thank you, honey. Yeah, yeah, okay, now I remember. Um, yeah, we're gonna talk about uh, Yacht stuff, or Jot, or however you said, probably Yacht, um, later, I'm just uh, not thinking about it, but I am trying to see others' um, videos um, that I already watched and, ugh, wrong color, that I already watched and put into my um, uh, playlist, so I can see, because I know there was something that I wanted from Yacht Store. But I've heard I have really nice embellishments. Um, um, did you see any butterflies there? Butterflies or uh, what else? What else do I like? Um, rabbits and stuff. I don't know. Still. I've seen some stamps though uh, in our... Um, in our dollar store, because it's not dollar store, but it's similar to that, let's say, because it's... But man, if you, if you, if I know that um, in Germany and Aust um, 
in Austria, they actually have those action stores. I would, I would go just there and would not buy in Slovenia at all. Cause, yeah, um, for me, price is something. You know, if I can buy something for ten dollars, um, let's say dollars here in Slovenia and I get three things and I can go um, in action store and I can buy for ten dollars like 10 or 15 stuff you know that's a big 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 difference for me um, come on what is it um, so yeah just wanted to point that out And I don't know why people don't use the um, colored um, pencils anymore. Because they're so fun and so easy to use. And uh, you don't need any um, knowledge how to use them, right? So we should use them more because they're versatile still. Even though they're not blending with any water and stuff. Well, some are, but not as much, but you know. Mm. Whoops. I just test um, the colors if I like them. Together. That's what I'm doing here. And I am pressing as much as possible here. Don't, don't get me wrong, I do press down, but that waxy thingy is too too waxy for me to really press it down so it could show um so what i'm gonna do is now i'm thinking about doing something hmm i'm going to fix this image and see if that waxy thing goes away. I'll be right back. I'm back. Who else is here? Um, I don't know where I've seen it, but they had such a beautiful not 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 stickers, uh, more like die cuts, um, like big butterflies, beautiful butterflies. Um, I'll check. I'll check the video. I think um, crafting Vicky had some. Um, that were very very beautiful um i think they were a set of 30 in a pack and they had three or four different packs of colors um pink purple uh green something like that i think um what so i'll try to let me see if this is um I think it's a bit better, but maybe I'll have to fix it again. Well, I think it's much better. Hmm. I think it's much better just to fix it if the paper 
It's funny. Um, this. And we had this. I think here is more color, but here when I went light, it's the same as here. So... I'm gonna fix it again now that it's uh, colored. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm just gonna leave it here. Um, no, you don't need to go to Michael's. No, just dollar store. I don't want expensive stuff. Just get to the dollar store if you want to go. Go there and check if they have it. If they don't have it, uh, I think you're gonna go in a few weeks. So don't don't bother. You know. So I'm going to put these two beautifuls in my my cut stamped printed images. <laughs> the pile of this. I think they don't belong here. They're so beautiful. Okay then, then get me some yacht stuff. If, if, if it's not expensive for you to wait a little bit longer or to go to the dentist more often, then... Because <laughs> I think dentist is more expensive that, uh, you know, than waiting. So, I don't mind, hon. I don't mind. This is still not... not, a, not fixed. Um, so... Oh, I have those here. Um, that I'm not feeling like coloring right now for some weird reason, eh? Because I I think I'm gonna fix the paper and I'm gonna it's it's gonna be the coloring experience gonna be better. <laughs> God bless. <laughs> what do you think it is? Um, okay, so let me think. I do have um, maybe we should do this. I've tried only this one, I think. I know, but you said it's near it, so I just assumed, you know, since it's right next to it. Um, so should I do this one or... Nah. What do you say, guys? Yes or no? Just, I need... Maybe small ones that could go. I'll I'll take a page that it's something. I I'm gonna use this as well. Um, let me just grab some. I know I have some outside lying and crying to me that I should take them. That what the heck? I ripped them out and. Then I'm not gonna do anything with them, or what? Okay, I'm gonna use this, this, and this. Ugh. Um. Oh, 
Okay. Okay. I sh I'm not gonna say any... I I'm gonna be quiet and just nod, okay? <laughs> um, some pages... I can actually use this side as well. Um, that I made with, um... Who knows what? Watercolors? I don't know. But I have some. So I can actually stamp on this. Um, this oh, I'm not gonna go saying what it is. Um, this was actually stamped and then I went over with um, watercolors, which you don't see the black color so good. So let me see. I can use this one as well. And this one. Because um, I hate that. It looks ridiculous. Um, could use this. Could use this, but I'm not going to. And I just uh, backed up with uh, something sturdy. This could be for Katya. Um, let me see. Let me see what I have in on the other envelope. I mean, when the background is like this, I have to have um, like white acrylic or I have to have the white, um, you know, pad. I could use this one because it's lighter. Just some, you know, papers that I tore out and I um, actually stack them in envelopes so I can see what's inside. That helps me immensely, um, so I don't need to open each one and look. Oh, I hate that. If I can see it through, then that's all good. Um, so we set flowers, right? Um, let me just tweak this up if... I think it's... But I'm not sure if... Um, I don't feel any, any more grab on that. I think it's worse now. Made it worse. Um, okay, so I am going to put these pencils away because they are on the way, I guess. Mine, come back. Too many pencils in one thingy. I'll I'll order them by color late late um when I end with this stream. Like I do that. No, I don't. Just you know, I might. Crazy enough to do that. Um, can you imagine each time that you're using them, and you put them back in, you just do that. Oh. Yeah, but I don't mind, you know. Let them be. I don't mind at all. Quietly watching, eh? I think I'm going to put something, something. Maybe let's start with this one. But I have to ink a lot because the middle part is... Uh, where's the stamper? Stamp, stamp, stamp. I yeah, put it away, didn't I? Come back, stamper thingy block. I don't know if it's going to fit, but let's just see. Yeah, good, all good. I always check if the middle part is um, covered. <clears throat> Thank you. 
you know, whenever people are talking in any... I, I was a lurker or quietly watching for a long time, you know. Um, even I didn't do much live because I always miss them. Because um, most of the live are in... Um, in America so you know my time and their time yours your time so that's why I I didn't catch them but whatever I did even when I was listening to live music um, on YouTube I was just quiet you know I put it on and did my own stuff or I was just listening you know I was not but those those yeah had a lot of people so if you're saying it like that But either way, you know, they have to do what they have to do, right? Oh, love it. I'm going to put another flower there because I think um, something that doesn't have um, so much um, black thingy on the middle. Um, let's try this one. I'm just glad that I'm wide today, like wide screenish. Not just this, I have this much space. I had literally this much of space, which bugged me yesterday. It was yesterday? Yeah, I think it was. It was, right? I don't mind if they're reading chat, if uh, you know? But if they do or if they don't... Um, you know, they can only hear one side of conversation if that doesn't bother them. Because it does sometimes. It does, does bother me, you know. Oh, let's do this. Then I'm all good with that. Watercolors. Uh, depends. This is um, some gesso. That's why it's different color. Gesso. Oh, uh, on the lightest is gesso and then watercolors, I think. Um, uh, this is watercolor. This is acrylic, because uh, I know by the touch of it. And this is acrylic as well, uh, like credit card thingy. I'm going to show you. Um, don't worry, hon. Should Katya... Will Katya love this flower if I make it yellow? Let's hope she does, because I'm going to cut out. Well, um, in that way, we we should do something, you know, um, that it's not that it's private, you know, private sessions. If you want that, um, yeah, I know what you mean, but you know. I hope she's gonna like this flower. I'm going to do two or three more flowers and then let's really start fussy cutting. Um, Cause I think I've been doing this for a very long time now. And I like this flowers, uh, come baby. This petal shape, I don't know the name, you probably know the name. I just like them and it's getting hotter. Okay. These are probably the flowers that are, um, um, coming out right now or they're already probably out um, I just don't know the name hello Elizabeth welcome hope she's gonna like those flowers hello Zoe hello Angie Mm 
Can you see that? I think I, I, I don't know why, but I like this one better than this one. It looks just, it looks beautiful. It looks like um, somebody painted it or, you know, but it's just a wacky paper. <laughs> Oh, gi giraffes? Um, I... That's a good idea. I think I have a stencil, so... Of giraffes. Um, I'm going to try to squeeze it in right here. Because uh, I did found, found some um, bigger images, and I did fussy cut some for her as well. She's gonna have so much yellow stuff to do and to put into her um, thingy. I'm just gonna cover this whatever that is. Pumpkin. Hello Katya! Maybe you can see that it's very light here. I'm gonna trace that with my um pen so it's all good it's all good um but i know i need more um, embellishments so i'm just starting with these and i did cut a bunch out from um advertisements as well so cut tear Cool. That's so nice that your mom's watching as well. That is dope. Wish my mom would, would watch it with me. It's not TV. It's internet. And yeah, she does. She's watching Voyo. All the time. Mm. Let's do another flower. I'm just going to close this for a second. Sometimes. I need some cushion for this so I don't need to press so 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 much I think we should all watch um um, crafty Mama on Friday. Just somebody has to has to let me know when that is, cause I have no clue. Just count six more hours to whatever whatever time she's gonna be on, and that's how I'll know. We are um, central. It's gonna be central um, Eastern 
time. What? No? Did I fuck it up? Yeah. Okay, after, after, um... Oh, it's Friday. We're not gonna go, um, change the clock yet. But it's Aita. CET means Central European time, but we're gonna go to Central European summer time, so CEST. Well, there you have an explanation for that. So we're not going to Central Eastern time, because we're not on the Eastern Hemisphere, uh, hemisphere or the Eastern Seaboard of the United States or whatever. Well, you can see that's the, that, that's the brains. <laughs> I'm always confused about that. And the Eastern time zone is in EST. Oh, cool. The Western one is PST, which is Pacific Standard Time. Thank you, Laura. I don't know if you can hear him saying this stuff, this smart stuff that I have no clue. Yeah, if you watch these. Yeah, we are. He he is too, you know. Every time he goes to sleep, he's time traveling. All of a sudden, when he closes his eyes, the clock is like 2 a.m. And when he opens them, it's like 7 or 6 a.m. And he's like, whoa! How did that happen? I know I was sleeping just for a second. So he... I'm just gonna close my eyes for a minute. Yeah, he, he he's closing his eyes for a minute. So that's how that goes. So... I am gonna tweak this a little bit though, because... I'm wondering if I do some tweaks, if they're gonna look... they're, mo they're gonna pop more. Just that. And I don't think this is gonna pop much. So I'm gonna do a little bit of white just because to highlight some areas. <laughs> oh, this red looks horrible. Horrible. What the heck is wrong with these leaves? Coloring on watercolor paper is usually always very nice. Um, has nice grip and such. So, if you're doing that, Oh, wrong space. Well, that happens too, eh? So, let's calmly just fussy cut stuff out and see. Did you listen to music that I sent you, Laura? I think I always want to say your name in Slovenian, though. Maybe you would like Slovenian name. Who knows?
hope you can see. I don't know. Oh, yeah, it focused. It's a little grungy, but, you know. It's all good. Let me do the, um, this fresh, um, um, the color yellow ones for Katya. Hope she's gonna like them. Are you gonna like them? I think she's on, right? Can you imagine? I was I was um, recording yesterday this live um, live stream, and my um, tablet had um, eighty or ninety percent of battery, and I did three hours. And when I finished, it said that it have like um, twenty five percent. So I was like, "Whoa, man!" This is my thing for making videos. Because everything else that I used, um, it was like um, my older phone. I think that it probably was um, at 45 minutes. He, he wanted to have a juice. Um, like. So. Yeah. I'm glad this tablet works good. It's not iPhone. It's not I iPad. I don't know if iPad has that much juice in in in, in it. I'm so concentrated on this flower. This is something I have to fix. So yeah, this. Hope you can see it. Doesn't this look very nice? Even though it's um, stamped on the paper um, book page. Come on, focus, you beast. I can see the uber proofing. I see the words more than uh, on the camera. <laughs> so, yeah, this is one way how you can actually get some embellishments, and 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 you know. Uh, let me see if I can find something, um, just to. It's the same like this. Just I I left a border here, um, because um, I didn't want to go in that tiny little space. But I, I, I could actually put a flower like this on and, you know, trying to find something with darker background. But I guess I'm not going to find because I have a lot of uh, light colors. Maybe green? No. You know, just, just this. So, this is for um, Katya, and uh, I'll do all for Katya right now, so I can just put it into her stash, um, keeping this. Though, this, these two are very similar, yeah. Thank you, Angie. I hope you try and make some uh, for yourself as well. I 
think these are more easy to cut out. So, who is on, on here watching me cut beautiful flowers? Um, just raise your hand. Yes, no. I can do it on stream. Just a tipa dana. Laka pa se um. Ti sto čisto posuda vandaš, če se ti da. Okay. Well, that's gonna be on the internet forever. And another flower for, oh, I, do I have to cut? Yeah, found something to cut. But it's a little bit um, harder to see with uh, this text. Hello, Christy. I'm glad you are. I don't know if anybody from like all of you know how to fussy cut but if somebody that doesn't know how to fussy cut I'm gonna link a video down below because the girl explains it very good and um, she has a good video and I don't I don't know why 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 I shouldn't just um, link something because you know it's very good explained and I don't know I don't know the lady but um, you know it just it's it's just that when whenever you're trying to find something because I I needed to to find it uh, for the group um, so it took me quite a long time to actually find it um, my YouTube was not showing it very like at the beginning, so that was bummer. Uh, okay, another one. So I don't know if I should show you. It's Katia here. Oh, you're back! So I am not going to show the content. But you can see this three, they, they look like um, yellow greenish, so I hope that's good with you. They're like neon, neon color. Um, and I am putting into your uh, yellow thingy box. Come on, where is it? Mm, that's, that smells so wonderful, honey. I should get bigger. This is it? Yeah. Oh, it smells so good. So let's let's move on. I still have a few more uh, minutes, days, hours, years. Let's do this one. This reject. You can with no problem make stickers as well with this. 
beautiful um, cutouts if you want to. Oh, I wanted to check a little bit here. There we go. This is going probably to take me like, what, forever? But while watching or, uh, you know, listening to a stream, it's always nice to fussy cut. Can you hear the television? I mean, the movie. He is watching. Yay! Yeah, my phone ringing. All the discs. I have to retouch this once. And with book pages, please just check if, like, on the corner, if book page goes, like, um, if it sinks in. I don't know how to say, but it, some inks just spread, uh, like, left and right, really strangely, whenever inks. Like, this black thing is. Like those, um, you know, the permanent inks. Sometimes they do that. Depends on the paper, though. Like I said. And I think whenever you go over the lines, like you sketch it out, um, usually looks better. Um, because um, they're more dark. This is something that I really love. That it's defined very good. Cause yeah, you can you can stamp it and it's like you cannot even see and just cut it out. But you know, it's always nice to if you think it's not so defined to define it. Take a, take a little bit of more time and you know. And whenever you do a lot of them, maybe you should try to take a um, just a regular copy paper and try to sketch them out. And if you do that, you know, successfully, that you like your flowers that you sketched out, um, cut those out and color them and use them as well. Or you can scan them, put on another, um, print on another sheet of paper and color them and cut them out and you'll have them forever. Right? And they're gonna be yours and you could do whatever with them. Truly. Yeah, do do this first with uh, with pencil and then just go trace. Because now that's 0 0.5. If you can check, if you can actually see the difference between these two. 
This it has to focus. Can you see the difference? How light something is and how how um better it looks? And the text isn't so um the text doesn't like rub onto your uh, eyes, I think, uh when it's more defined. Um because for me, right now, I, I couldn't just sketch something like this and just go with a pen around. No, no way. That that would look like crooked and I wouldn't like it and then I would just toss it away. So, stamping it, that's a good, good way to actually use these things. Maybe we can find something else as well. So, let me cut just this little flower out. Hope guys you're having fun and doing relaxed whatever you're doing right now. My boyfriend is eating and it smells so good and my mouth is watery like the banana pudding. Oh my god, banana pudding. Now I went too far. Just... A smidge too far. I <laughs> want banana, yeah. Man. How cute is this? I always want to show you what I'm doing because I think you actually seeing it um, up close makes a huge difference. And um, the trick with gesso, so you put the gesso first on the page with a credit card and then when it dry um, you go over with um, watercolors it gets you like you don't see that the page so much so if you have a problem that that bothers you a bit or a bit more so you don't like to stamp on the book pages do that because um, yeah sometimes I like that a lot uh, even with um, darker colors I like that there is um, some variation uh, in the paper that's looks it's look it looks very nice so I just decided I'm gonna leave these to cut stamp cut some other uh, moment and this one's gonna be very beautiful whenever um, I'm gonna put color in uh, maybe this is gonna be yellow <laughs> and I just know I have something else to show you Oh, let me see. Okay. Give me a sec. So the other day, that's probably a long, long time ago. I was coloring this page and this page was actually a copy of um, actual the booklet that I have um, that actually has um, a lot of um, coloring pages in and I um, it's not the original size I made it smaller and I colored it let me put it let me show you focus baby yeah and I just colored it like it didn't take me a long time um, and then when I was finished uh, the paper was like a4 
and when I was finished, I was thinking, what the heck should I do? And I was start, I start doodling and doodling and doing some sketches and, you know, uh, then you actually get something like this. I uh, made, I made um, cupcakes with pencil and then trace it with uh, black pen. And I put, this is a copy, I think. I don't think this is original. No, this is original, sorry. So I put this on scanner, scanned it and reprint it out. And I do some uh, stuff on, uh, you know, whatchamacallit, uh, the thingy. Yes, the thing. Photoshop. And I did some stuff on there and I made myself a, um, this. So what I did is um, I basically took one cupcake and flipped it so it's a um, mirror image and I can put like... Uh, I was making this for actually for paper clips. So initially what I wanted to do but I got lazy after, <laughs> after that. I wanted to put a cupcake on the front and the back and whenever you would turn the paper clip you would see both sides and you know the cherry on top would be in the same direction whenever you would turn it um that's what i was wanted to do but now i just have them for embellishments but i can print them off whenever and you can actually find this on on the group um on the file section and you can print something like that for yourself as well um if you like them and uh, you want to have them and make some embellishments or paper clips for that for that matter if you like cupcakes right um yeah so that is it uh let me see if i have something else i i, I mean i would fussy cut this out though like for embellishments um and i'm just trying to see if i have some other maybe this i will try to fussy cut that and put a little bit of color Oh, this is me coloring it. I have a few copies. Yes, of course. <laughs> I, I I'm almost never do just one or, you know, try to do more. I am trying to find something that is that is manageable enough to fussy cut out. Um But I'm not sure that I'm going to find something like that right now because I do have some other stack of... This is actually the whole stack of uh, um, coloring pages that I have. So if you were in, like curious what I'm doing. And I'm just trying to see if there is something that I can actually put out. But I don't think that I have some small designs. Um... <laughs> Let me see. Nope, I don't think so. They're all bigger designs. And I do try to, to save the... Uh, how do you say? Um, coloring pages. And I don't mind that they look like childish, that childish a little bit. I think that's great too. And... Uh, no, sorry. Let's, let's just stick with, with these butterflies for now. So, the other thing, if you don't have stamps, you can actually, yes, you can actually um, make a copy of um, coloring page or you can um, um, scan coloring page and make it smaller or bigger and then print it out and uh, just make some coloring and fussy cutting, right? So simple. I forgot to put something in. Um, oh, 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 I found something else as well. Let me share that on the video as well. Um, so the other, I always want to say the other day, but it's never the other day for me. <laughs> Um, printed out this cute, lo I love them. 
uh, have to just um, color them because I did the first two rows or one row um, I colored it and cut it out so this is good as well um, and these were all free though um, this is um, Star Wars emojis that I found um, on the internet like PDF and I put them in um, uh, I put them in um, they were pictures separately pictures uh, I put them in um, what is it called Word uh, Microsoft Word and just stack them in and print them off um, so yeah color them make them yours make them like you know your colors whatever you need um let me see what else i can find if there is something interesting even though the time is of the essence now hey trying to find some smaller designs just to give you an example but usually like flowers oh there was one time that i actually find found the um nice image and that person really loved uh, the lego um characters uh i think and um the harry potter and this was the image that i found so it's lego harry potter and uh, i colored it and just put it on the bigger envelope and it looked very nice i still have some pictures of that but um yeah it looked nice so uh if you make it smaller, if you make this image actual smaller, you can have small embellishment. It doesn't need to be that big. And then you can find probably something like this. Um, these are just cute little um, um, sewing um, style thingies. And I, I just love it. Um, I didn't actually try to actually color this, but I will probably someday um, and they look just cute I mean they make so many designs and I find a lot of stuff for free um, so if you if you can just check online or tell me and I can find something for you right and put it online like put it on the group and you can download whenever you want um, and reprint it or you know give it to your friends and stuff so so much about that just just plain old uh, coloring pages right and I do till 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 today I do scan all of my coloring books that I get just because um, when I didn't I had a problem with um, with me coloring in actual coloring book, I had a, like OCD thing and I didn't, couldn't want because it's my only one. And when I'm finished with it, I cannot, I cannot color again. I cannot cut it up. I, you know, I had that thing and probably you guys have it as well. Oh my God, you're eating chips. That's so loud. <laughs> and... Um, <laughs> I w all I wanted to say that I like to um, scan them so I can do whatever I want. I can cut it up many times, you know. Um, that's all. You eating monster. How can you eat chips like quietly? You can't, so. Okay, so I think I have a few more minutes. Um, I am just going to um, continue on fussy cutting because... Uh, I think I told you all about the embellishing part and stuff like that. If any questions, please ask, please ask away or write it into the in the comments below. Love to know if you have a question for me. I'm just going to put this um, babies away. Beautiful, beautiful babies. I have I have a lot of stuff to actually cut today but I guess that's gonna be um, three day job <laughs> okay and uh, yeah 
let me see what else did I have. So I did find out, um, find this um, like when yesterday, I think. Maybe you can see it's a um, fountain. I think you can say it in in English. And I'm just gonna fussy cut out because I think it's gorgeous and I don't see many fountains like this at all. So I'm back to fussy cutting and shutting my mouth for a bit because um, I need to... Where's my coffee? Let, let me just drink my coffee because I have only two... Three. Good coffee. Um, oh, the brick pattern, that's going to be... I'm totally neg neglecting the chat though. Should I check? If anything is meant for me, just um, tag me because no banana for me just had cheese and crackers. Mmm, banana. Oh my. I actually think that sharing your art like um, making embellishments and stuff from it that that that's always nice uh, if you can if you you know want to this paper is very thin Yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't. I didn't um, share any links. I am just um, look. I'm. I'm going to give a link, and I am seeing that people are joining, but some people just don't um, answer the the questions. I. I. You know. It's. It's hard for for you know to just get a trolls or something like that so I really like people to answer the questions they're not that hard they're just you know um, you know just that nothing nothing like um, um, nothing else it's always nice to know that you know trolls trolls are the the people that we want to avoid um He's an eater. That's for sure. I'm choppy right now. I'm not concentrating. my time is off okay let me snooze for five minutes so I'm glad that I did um, put the time out um, just because I tend to lose time of you know how much I'm how long I'm streaming either way whenever I do something I lose time of you know because I just focus so much on something and um, time just flies 
I wish there would be, you know, a day that would not have 40, 40, um, 24 hours, but like 48. That would be nice. One day, so many hours, I can do it all. I can sleep six hours and then I have just, oh, so much time to do anything. Okay, I uh, discarded the rest, so I think it looks nice. Um, especially on the, you know, um, something like a background, let's say. That's too dark, I think. But I did found, uh, find this in the... In the... What is it called? The flower thingy book. I'm not sure if I like it or if I don't. Somewhere in the middle for me. Maybe because it's too dark. I don't know. Um, I did scan it. If anybody maybe wants to to have something like that, I don't know. So um, how would I actually cut this ones? Um, not fussy cutting, but just with um, what is it called? You know, chopping the paper <laughs> um, and just cut it nicely in rectangles um, I think I would do that and I even love this ones that um, like our um, old one I think I don't know what language is this it's not Slovenian at all so yeah but I think they're they're very nice um, even I have some picture of fabric so that is what I'm gonna do with that paper and um, uh, this is from an advertisement. I hoard this kind of fruit um, because the price isn't like over it. Um, it's the whole fruit and I can just cut it um, with a border, like white border or just without any border out. I would not use this if I'm not trying to find anything green, but you know. And I like this um, nuts and probably I would cut the this one too um, but yeah citrus those those are my favorite I guess um, and bananas obviously and you can find with those um, thingies um, advertisements you can find a lot of t um, TV screens that actually have really nice um, designs on them this one has um, flowers um, roses uh, which I might put into I don't know the whole design into a clothing tag, you know, and just put something, um, a word, something over it. I think it would look neat. Um, yeah. So, bananas. That's what I was saying. <laughs> okay, this is another thing that I, um, just seen today. Um, because it's more, it's bigger. <laughs> uh, they usually put it, like, a, in a small image. So maybe you can see it's actually a cookie and the um, glass, um, the cup of milk or something. So I'm probably going to cut just this one out because um, I think it looks nice. Um, not sure if it, with a border, I'm just roughly cutting. So I'm not sure if I'm going to do all three of them. Um, but I think, I mean, it looks nice. It's, you know, even if you put it onto your um, envelope for mailing out uh, to embellish and you can do the scene and you can do like small, um, you know, stickers that you have. You can do a scene with that because I love to see, you know, different stickers and you can actually represent something. It's not just throwing stickers on the envelopes and you know and this balloon is it's very nice I think it's nice for me no um, maybe I'll do the small one as well the yellow one um, so this is I'm gonna smooth it again um, I, I just wanted to show you what I have prepared because obviously I I got distracted with something else and um, yeah so that's that and um, this little, this big guy, I take this out and 
if I need a guy, I would probably take him out, but I don't need him. I would put some hair on or, I don't know, uh, nice something, clothing. And uh, I would use this background for um, ADCs or, you know, something like this. Um, and these pictures are actually from those big newspapers. That's why it's so big. Um, you know, and who would love to have something like that? I know it's big, but, you know, can you use it? Can can you actually use it for something? Would, would it be like on the page and you would just check it like this? Or what? what would you do with this? I think it's beautiful, just... My problem with big pictures are is that I, I, I don't know where to pop them because they're so big, you know. Elizabeth, I think you are already in the group though. Um, I think I already uh, accepted you like few, 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 few times ago, didn't I? Hmm. I think I did accept you. Anybody can share anything on the page. Um, if they feel like to, they want to, they want to put a video on uh, or anything. They can do that. I don't mind. Nobody's actually saying a lot of things. Um, okay, so this picture, it's beautiful, okay? Um, it's in Slovenia, I think, and and I just couldn't pass it on. Um, but yet again, I have a problem with pictures like that because I don't know where to put them. It might be funny for some people. I've never tried it, but I got an idea with this. <laughs> okay. So, um, the other day I was thinking what to do. I need some, I needed some pictures and I was like, well, you know, I can make a scene with some, um, slippers. So I was thinking to actually, um, cut the slipper out, uh, put it onto some, um, background and put some googly eyes on and I would actually have a live, um, like living, um, Yeah, just, um, I forgot how to say it, but yeah, um, just to play, to play with images, what I can put as, as a, as a, you know, um, it's, it's funny to see actually, um, the slipper with, with, an, with eyes on or, you know, those slippers that have, that are very soft and they're like, um, piggies and bunnies and stuff like that. Um, that's why I was thinking about, about, um, putting googly eyes on. Um, bottles. I don't know if anybody has, um, a thing for the bottles, but I think this is the first or the second bottle that I actually got, um, from the, the, let's say, magazine shit. Um, found, uh, this guy that I'm gonna fussy cut out and put it onto something like this. It's gonna fit perfectly. Um, and probably I'm gonna do the orange thing for the background as well. Uh, I'm basically showing you more stuff because, um, there is time limit for me. Um, citrus, yes, those are all things that I love and I'm going to fussy cut them out. Um, I am going to fussy cut this eggs out and put it onto an envelope or um, for mailing out or junk journals or, you know, whatever. Because I think the images are nice, even though they're thin, flimsy paper. I don't mind that. Um, these two guys, two rabbits. Um, I would fussy cut them both out. I just have to think about this one because I have to put something over here. So it would probably be a big flower or, you know... Um, something something to cover that thing and I think it looks gorgeous um, you can put it on the card you can put it you know yeah snoozing again uh, you can put it anywhere um, and this one I think I would cut it out but I'm not sure if I'm gonna use it 
yet because it's very light um on the on the head well we'll see maybe 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 and another egg sure all from um advertisements that we get from the stores um they have wonderful pictures i have no clue how much they actually spend on printing those um these flowers i would actually take um the green thing everything green and just put it to something else on the bottle or you know just and here i would just take the tops of flowers um to put it somewhere uh you know some fruit again with the television uh, with the um screens so beautiful flowers um again for tags this is just for a background i mean you could fussy cut out if you want to but i think it's not so um it's not so sharp you know i know i noticed that this is um more sharp than this one's uh, one behind so i would use it for background that's for sure um so another thing chairs um this is actually the second or the third set that I actually that was actually very interesting, and it doesn't didn't have didn't have very weird background. So I am cutting this out. Um, I'm leaving this green, and leaving um, l I'm gonna leave like a border around here down there. Uh, so white border uh, on the bottom, and I'm gonna try to really fussy cut all this stuff out. Um, above um, again some flowers and you don't even actually need to fussy out everything out you can just fussy out around the flowers and just pick some flowers out if you need to um, you know just it's it's imagination what what you have to you know you have to have or adopt you know um, paintbrush no clue but probably it's gonna be for something um, in with tags because it's small one this is the only word that I found um, um, in in all the advertisements that I had this is the only thing and um, that it's semi-english you know I mean it's English it's not just semi-english fruit more fruit um, this is just for Yagode um, strawberries um, if I would take this one out, just just this one, because this is, I would probably not cut this one as well. Um, let me see what I have. I do like to use stuff like this. Maybe you've seen it before when I was, I'm a little bit rushing, but this was from the same ad. Um, just use it for the color. I don't mind that it has like 10% off on um, everything. Um, so I would use background like this and probably you know some i don't mind that it's white um it's something additional that you can actually put for your backgrounds and you don't need the cardstock and stuff um like nice design paper or you know just whatever you can find bamboos uh ficus i don't know if that's even a thing that you can say that in english but this small trees they have white background what i very much like because these are probably the only two because we got two um same um advertisements um i'm gonna fussy cut them out with white border and i have the right they're they're perfect for stuff like this or atcs um i love this um woman smelling the bread the bread has something very nice um nice design on it this is gonna probably be for um, Dong Journal. Yet again, I don't know how to actually open this. Um, so I'll have to figure out, maybe it's going to be a bigger size um, Dong Journal. Um, another thing that I um, just pulled out from <clears throat> children's book. Um, I am in love in these images. It's It's... Oh, I'm out of um, out of frame. In love, I like how they actually um, made it and the colors, and it looks it looks like it was made with watercolors, you know. And I just like that. 
Um, five more minutes. Not done yet. I know it's a bit glossy, so I'm not sure if you can see it, but um, it's very, very nice. Um, and what I do, I scan it and then just um, in Photoshop, I try to make more images um, so I have more. And I do cut this up. <laughs> Um, because if I have more, I feel more safer, safer, and I don't, um, you know. And these two little flowers are from yesterday that I'm going to cast, um, fussy cut out, um, and use it, um, either on the, on the in junk journal or you know, on journaling cards, whatever. It's really, you know. Um, did I had something else in mind to show? I think that's basically it. Oh, 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 yes, yes, yes. So, the other thing that you can actually do if you have some craft paper or um, other colors of paper, let's say those printer papers that are actually have color, um, colored papers, um, you know what I'm talking about probably. You can stamp on those and you actually already have a color. I'm going to fussy cut this. I'm not sure if I'm going to color this because I very much like it. Um, okay, so I was thinking that you could actually put um, even, even printer paper you can print onto your um, colored paper, uh, like printer colored paper, you know, and fussy cut it out the same way as you would... Um, stamp it on so I think yesterday I was asking you guys if somebody was um, having a problem with their um, die cuts that they were when they were new they were not uh, cutting the paper so hands up if that actually happened to anybody from you know Yeah, Elizabeth, I like I do that as well. I do that often, but the problem is that sometimes um, when I'm doing these cards, ADCs and such like that, I like that they are not so bulky. If you know what I mean, because I put I tend to put um, those um, stuff on them, and they are just um, they're already bulky with with um, embellishments like with um, bling and stuff, so that's what i like but if you like it for your adcs and small things like that yeah sure do it and um if you want to have it like as a sticker just try to put it on something sturdier like cardstock or um what is it called um more sturdy magazine or advertisement and just put it on and then fussy cut it out um don't don't fussy cut before because you're doing work twice, not just once, you know. I've seen a lot of people fussy cut and then glue it in, onto a piece of paper and fussy cut the same on the same line again. That's I think that it's um, um, losing a lot of time. And I have to say one more thing, important one. Whenever you're going to have a white background on the on the let's say embellishment that you want to cut out. If you turn it around and if you actually see some design or something black or just some lines on the back, I advise you that if you're going to actually put that thing somewhere that is very, very white, you know, you are going to see some lines on the front side. I don't know why that is, but um, if you put it on something more darker, let's say, for example, this, the lines just you know, you can't see what was on the other side. So I'm not sure if you noticed that, you know, now I can, I, I cannot know that this was actually cut from a magazine. You know, I cannot see any lines that are behind. Whenever I put it on white cardstock or, or on white paper, I can see a line right here and right up there. Just some, some quick tip. Maybe um, it's going to save you a lot of, um, um, how to say nerves because I've I've 
I was pretty pissed a uh, few times because I was seeing what's on the other side and that just bothered me. Um, cool. Have a great time, Laura. I, I'm going to just finish. I, I'm on last five minutes, I hope, and I'm going to finish for today and we'll see what I'm going to come up. Um, I'm just reading the chat if anybody is wondering what I'm doing right now. Oh, so, uh huh, okay. Bye bye. Sleep tight. You both sleep tight and, and, and have a nice evening. So, I think I'm almost, you know finished with this and 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 if you are going to stamp or print on um, this kind of paper your colors are going to be different expect that too um, so I think I covered everything um, if not you know there's always going to be a part two or part three if I miss anything and I'm gonna remember later um, I hope you got some information some new ones or Oh, 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 we didn't finish yet. No, um, nobody, nobody told me if, if there are things, um, there are die cuts, if they were not, um, cutting the paper, if they had any problem, if it's no, just say no. So, so, so I know, um, cause I, I, I wanted to show you, well, uh, a thingy. Okay, so I had a problem. Uh, one of my die cut, uh, cutting st stencils, or however I should call them, they were not cutting paper at all. They were actually, uh, whenever I tried to um, put it through, it was just um, somewhere was cut, somewhere wasn't, so I was really pissed. And then I was thinking what to do, what to do, what to do, and I made these. I know they are not... Um, they have no color, they're just um, metallic. And I try to to actually, um, come on, color them with, I uh, can't remember with what, but I think it was an alcohol ink. Uh, and it didn't go well, so I might do that um, again. Um, and I made this, and this is actually just plasticky thingy. It's not, it's not a, um, you know, those, um, what is it called? The foil? It's not a foil, it's actually a plastic thingy. And what it is, is basically... Um, let me see if I have some to show. Um, what it is, is just simple, simple this thing. And um, it's thin, it's like soup, soup. What is it called? Yeah, soup uh, baggy. And in the inside is like this nice texture. But the thing is, um, I had um, the stencils were not cutting good. And I had to rip this, you know, because it's only, um, uh, how to say, um, they, they just uh, made the shape and was still on the paper. But I think the problem was because these um, baggies have actually um, plastic between them, between the paper and this thingy, it's a plastic, like uh, foil, plastic foil. So I was thinking maybe you guys um, can try if you want to get something like that and your, your dies are cutting good, you know? Maybe you should try Let me just empty this. Come on. Maybe you should try something like this, okay? Um, this is actually, like you can see, milk carton. And it has the same, same, same texture, if you can see. I mean, it's shining. It's not as shiny as this, but I think it's good enough. Um, you know, I don't know if you can see. Can you see this one, the, the actual soup, um, 
baggy is more shiny but I think this would look as as nicer as well and you can probably try with alcohol inks to spritz it uh, to see if um, the ink actually goes into the crevices um, I think this is actually a cardboard so you can you can cut it really nice and um, you can cut it really nice and even tear it really nicely so that's why I'm showing you this because I just got an idea that maybe I'm going to try with this as well and we have a lot of stuff like this probably from juice and stuff I we have we, we buy milk in this so okay I just think this is this is um, last minute uh, I'm just going to leave you with this idea I hope you try it out um, and if you do just uh, let me know I want to see what you were um, what did you make uh, with it um, yeah comment below please give me a thumbs up if you like this video um, um, and yeah just happy crafting uh, and if, if you have any um, question for me please um, type it below I am going to put my um, link from the group here again so if anybody wants to um, join they can join and uh, yeah thank you very much for watching have a very nice evening or day or uh, whatever hour is right now that you are watching and